All right, and we back again. All right, and we back again. First off, man, fuck the fan. Yeah, fuck the fan. Fans in the background, guys. If you hear it, I apologize. It's hot as fucking shit in here. So I got the fan on me right now. So we're going to have to deal with that. But, uh, man, did y'all miss me yet? Maybe not. Maybe. Yeah. All right. Anyway, I'm here today because we've got an unboxing for y'all. A first of sorts here at 606 TV. Um, I've heard about this company for a while. Um, I've heard mixed reviews, so I was kind of hesitant about jumping in, but I saw the franchises and I jumped in. I actually ordered this box and one more, and this box was extremely delayed. This box is probably about two to three months late. Uh, they had some errors due to COVID-19. So I actually canceled the subscription to this box. Uh, I got this box and the next one and I canceled after that. Uh, depending on how these two boxes go, I may get that subscription back because supposedly they've added some extra shit in this to kind of make up for the super delay. But we'll see how it goes. Because we got the first ever BAM Horror Box on this channel. This is the April number four horror box 2020. The franchises were Cabin in the Woods, Texas Chainsaw Massacre, and The Walking Dead. I love The Walking Dead. I love Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And Cabin in the Woods is pretty dope too. So I jumped on this one. And I jumped on box five next month's box as well, which I will be doing on this channel as soon as it arrives which I heard will be very soon. So be on the lookout for that for that video as well. So let's jump in to the BAM Horror Box. Let's see if this box can impress me and uh, gain my business back. So we're gonna, we're gonna pop the top here. First thing in the box, we got the BAM protector paper very nice touch okay I see a few cool ass oh oh I see one thing in here I like very much first thing let's start with the pen we got the monthly pen looks like this comes from cabin in the woods it is the uh, the guy with the saw blade through his head there you go right there as a dope dope pen will go well with my my horror pen set Next thing in the box, let's do this. This caught my eye right off. I'm a huge Michael Myers mark. My favorite three slashers. Michael Myers, Leatherface, and... Come on. Anybody know? Michael Myers, Leatherface, Jason Voorhees. But... Number one, we got the trading card, and it is of Mr. Myers, Michael Myers. Looks like it's an artist select card, uh, fan art. Let's see, the artist is Hal Moore. That's dope. The artist is Hal Moore for this for this card. This is super dope. This will go well with my Michael Myers collection. We got, looks like BAM puts a sort of like a scratcher lottery type card in there. Let's see. Let's do it. Scratch off. If you match three things, you get that item, supposedly. All right. Scratch and instant winner symbol. Match three, the same symbol. Look like I got a pin upgrade box, a pin upgrade box, and a free drop box. I almost got one matching. We got the, the two boxes and the pin. 
almost a winner there but it's all good we got next we got a prop replica and I already know where this is from I see I see this is a very nice prop replica this is pretty dope we got the King County Sheriff badge King County that is super dope that is a very nice prop replica comes with the necklace the badge I mean it's a it's a nice metal badge this is a very nice replica like for real this is very dope anybody doesn't know this is Rick Grimes his badge from The Walking Dead he was the King County Sheriff King County Georgia yeah very dope uh, that's the prop replica what else we got in here Oh, that's the digital it tells you about the digital handouts and stuff like that we'll put the box over here it looks like we got an extra art print from what it from what it looks like so oh man oh bam I love you guys this is freaking dope man I'm excited this was the extra art print that they threw in as kind of an apology for it being super late. And I, I'm excited. That I'm, I'm happy it was late now. You might have got me back as a customer. This print comes from my favorite movie of all time. We got The Crow. Mr. Eric Draven himself. Played by Brandon Lee, the late great Brandon Lee man the crow the first crow my all-time favorite number one favorite movie of all time man killer story great movie I suggest y'all check it out if you've never seen it part two and part three was super dope too but the original Brandon Lee he died making this movie Brandon Lee Eric Draven man I'm excited this is definitely going this is going up by my figures. My goodness. That's exciting. All right. So this one. All right. This, this is kind of odd. This is the art print. And this is the Texas Chainsaw Massacre. And it's a very odd art print. It looks like it's more of a crossover art print. I don't know. But we got Leatherface chasing the um, two of the uh, Peanuts characters, Charlie Brown characters. So that is very different. I, I, it's dope. My, I mean, Leatherface, definitely dope. This is from our fan art collection exclusive the band box hand signed by the artist let's see um, the artist is Adam MacArthur Adam MacArthur uh, was the artist that they showcased this month on the art print that's pretty dope and last but not least the autograph in the box mostly what a lot of people buy these uh, boxes for is the autographs that come in them this month well this this could go anywhere because we've had the walking the walking dead we had the badge cabin in the woods we had the pin texas chainsaw massacre was the art prop so this art print, I mean, this autograph could go either way. There's only one way to find out. Very nice. Very nice. Y'all ready? We have The Walking Dead. We have the governor and his daughter. 
when he's brushing her hair once she has turned to a walker and it looks like she signed that that is her I don't I, I'm not super aware of her name off the top of my head right now but yeah that is that is her signature you know very nice autograph this month very key a rememberable role in that TV show was the governor's daughter and that that's dope so we got the governor's daughter autograph uh, picture we got the Leatherface art print the crossover Charlie Brown type art print we got the extra art print my favorite my favorite thing in the box the fucking crow art print we got the Michael Myers sort of trading card we got the horror pin we got the uh, cabin in the woods uh, pin and we had the prop the prop replica of uh, Rick Grimes and the, the badge the sheriff's badge very dope very nice box overall I'm impressed um, you know I'm not just gonna let this one box sway me completely uh, next month's box I will see how that goes and if I'm impressed with that one then BAM box I I'll be back on that subscription list for the future horror boxes because I definitely appreciate the the horror boxes from one horror nerd to another and uh, much love to y'all. I appreciate everybody for tuning in, checking out all the unboxings that I bring to the channel. We're going to try to get the sub count up, guys. Uh, I'm a new, I'm new to the YouTube thing. I'm still finding my niches and stuff like that. But uh, let's keep those subscribers coming. Make sure y'all share this. Tell your homies if they're interested in boxes and they want to find out what the unboxings are all about, what the mystery boxes are all about. If they're a horror fan or a horror collector, you know what I'm saying? I always have horror items for sale. I don't keep everything I get in the boxes because I collect certain horror items and not a lot of stuff I'll keep, you know? So all you Walking Dead fans out there who might want this bad boy, hit me up because I probably won't be keeping it. I don't collect Walking Dead items. But, like I said... Make sure y'all stop the 606shop.com, the 606shop.com. Links are down below. Check out the gear, my gear, my personal gear. Make sure y'all check out the music. Check out the podcast. We got new podcasts dropping on a weekly basis. I got a brand new one that I'm going to drop right after this video. So make sure y'all check them out. Hit the subscribe button. Hit the notification bell. Keep it real. Man. With all the shit that's going on in the world, love each other, stand strong, wash your fucking hands, have some respect for one another, stay six feet apart, protest in peace, black lives matter, every fucking person matters, unity matters, but until we can fix one, we can never fix all of them. So let's get out there and stand in unity and show the fucking people that we can do this. Care for one another, y'all. And we out.